Hello YouTube, this is Bman95 here, and today I'll be showing you a quick demo on how to jailbreak any uh, Apple device running software version 3.1.2, 3.1.3, or 3.2. This is an untethered jailbreak. Um, it's also compatible with the iPad. iPad right here. Just turn on. iPad right here. Um, so, you're going to make sure that you uh, back up and sync your device with iTunes. Um, it does work with the 3GS, it does work with the 3rd gen, uh, so don't worry about any of that stuff. So, let's get started. First thing you're going to want to do is you want to go to spiritjb.com, spiritjb.com. So this is for the Spirit Jailbreak. Um, you're going to want to go there. Uh, I'll put a link in the notes. Once you're there, you want to choose the download for your system. I'm going to be doing this video for Windows. So download the file for Windows. Um, it's a very small file. It's about 4.35 megabytes. So what you're going to do is save that. Save that anywhere. I usually save stuff to the desktop. It just makes everything easier. Close. Alright, so there you can see the spirit icon right there. So next up, next thing you're going to want to do, you're going to want to grab an Apple iPhone connection cable or iPad, whatever it is in this case, and you're going to want to connect it to the computer. I'm going to plug it in, put the plug right there, take my iPad, it's iPad, I'm going to plug it in, so when you plug it in, what it's going to do is it's going to probably automatically open up iTunes, so I just updated my iTunes, so I'm agreeing. And it doesn't really matter what version of iTunes you're using. Uh, the jailbreak will work either way. So I'm just going to quickly click through this. Sure. So iTunes is probably going to open up here in a second. Alright, so there's iTunes. So the first thing you want to do, unless you haven't sy synced, synced your device yet, you're going to want to uh, you're going to want to cancel it. Um, make sure you do sync it though. If um, if you want to make sure that all your data is going to stay there in case something happens, um, I'll provide some help. But guys, remember this isn't perfect. Uh, it's still a uh, beta. It's pretty stable. But remember, you know I'm not the one who developed it. I'm just showing you how to do this. I'll try to help you out as best as I can, but don't go complaining about how it's untethered for one device and something. The way Apple works, you never know. Anyways, let's continue. So, got the iPad here, which is what I'm using. Plugged in. iTunes closed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to Spirit. Double-click that. I'm going to run it because it's a file from the internet. You're going to be asked to do that. And see, this is kind of like a Black Rain. There's just a little thing there that says Spirit shows you the device that's connected, the version of the software. So you want to, what you want to do is you're going to want to push this button that says Jailbreak. So I'm going to put the iPad here in a second. I'm going to push the button. It says Jailbreaking. It just said Restore in Progress, Restore Complete. Um, the iPad is now restarting, or iPhone, or whatever else you would be using this Jailbreak for. There's the Spirit Jailbreak loading screen. So you can see the bar moving across. iTunes just opened back up on my computer again. There we go. It's uh, still at that little wheel. It's not spinning. And there we go. It's connected. Since iTunes opened, it's going to want to sync. Just cancel that. Sorry about that. And there you go. The iPad's back. 
And I go all the way to the end. And there I have it. Cydia. That's a bit out of focus. But there is Cydia right there. Open up Cydia. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to let it reorganize. And it's just going to work everything out. But yeah, so that's how you jailbreak uh, any device running up to the 3.2 firmware version. Uh, yeah, hope this helps you guys out. If you just bought an iPad and want to tether it to your iPhone, you can use wi the Wi-Fi um, network application in Cydia to do that. Uh, I'll be showing a little uh, demo on that a bit later. But anyways, there you go. I'm Bman95. If you have any questions or suggestions for a new video, hit me an email at w or pardon me, hit me up an email at bman95vids at gmail.com. Once again, that's bman95vids at gmail.com. Everybody have yourself a great time.